So over here, you can see that I have a pain document. And if I were to go around and then draw around just like this, then what I can do is I can go to file, I can go to save, and then it'll give me an option to save my file. So in my case, I'm just going to go around into TutorTube and let's say I'm going to create a new folder called Paint just like this. And then inside of Paint, I'm just going to go around and let's say rename this out to the file name I want and then I'll save it. So now if I were to make changes onto this, so let's say I'm going to add in something and if I were to press save, what happens is that it replaces the same file. You do not get the dialog box anymore. But sometimes what happens is that you may want to save a copy of the file. So in that case, you can go to file and then go to save as. So on the save as option, you have an option to choose PNG, JPG, BMP, GIF and other formats as you can see. So I'm going to choose PNG, let's say for example, and then over here on K, you got the paint just like this. And if I were to save this as a different file name, now it is saved as a different file name. And I can make some changes right here and then save it out. And what happens is that it gets saved out onto uh, the, the new file that we just saved. If you want to create another co copy, then you go to file again, save as, let's say you want to save this uh, document as a BM BMP file this time. You just select that out and inside of Paint itself, you can rename the file and then save it out. And now what happens is that you got three copies of the same file. And that is how you can use the save as feature inside of Microsoft Paint. So I hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.